Hello there, I am Giant Growth More, Pokemon Emerald. In the last part, we took on the Moss Deep City Gym, well, most of it, except for the gym leaders, of course, because T and Liza, gym leaders, twins. And we also covered um, some stuff in Moss Deep City. So, I have Speedy and Peter up front. You kind of, I'd recommend you have like a flying type or a Pokemon that has a levitate ability to come out first, because this is a double battle, so one of your two Pokemon. And yeah, let's get started. Tate. Oh, I don't have to read that part. Hee hee hee, were you surprised? Foo 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 foo, were you surprised? They were... That there were two gym leaders? That there were two gym leaders? We're twins, we're twins. We don't have to talk. We don't need to talk because we can each determine what the other is thinking all in our minds. This combination of ours, can you beat it? Sure, I'll try. So it's a double battle. It's a good... You know... It's a good double battle, I guess. Unlike in Ruby and Sapphire, they have two more Pokemon, which are these, the Zatu and the Quadal. In Ruby and Sapphire, they just had a Solrock and the Lunatone. Right now they have a Zatu, a Quadal, a Solrock, and a Lunatone this time around in Pokemon Emerald. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to use Shadow Ball and the Zatu, because Zatu knows Sunny Day, and that's going to be trouble later on, because like, the Solrock has Flamethrower and Solar Beam, so it can just be launched Solar Beams in one turn. Right on, or in, and then also Sunny Day, because the sunlight it raises up the power of the flamethrower because the fire type move. So I'm gonna try to knock out that is that too as soon as possible. And yeah, use combine. So we'll see how this turns out. I did just about half, or just a little bit, just yeah, about half, I would say. Earthquake, oh, it's gonna hit Speedy, but it's not gonna hit Peter. Yeah, it doesn't affect Zatu because he's flying type 2. Hopefully this surf will take out the Zatu, but if that was super effective, I don't think it will. On the Cradle and I uh, dang it. Oh my gosh, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Well I kinda wanna I'll use the Shadow Ball on the Zatu, but I'm gonna use Peter's turn to heal uh well, I think I could take another hit, so I don't heal quite yet. I don't really want to heal up unless I need to. Yeah, it's going to use the high potion to do that. I should have taken the turn to heal, actually, but I'm not sure. Let's see how this turns out. Let's see if I'm wrong or not. Okay, I should, take, I should be able to take another earthquake. Yeah. I want to just knock out this clit all too. about half. Well, I'd rather have him, him use his, I'd rather Tate and Liza use their hyper potions on the Zatu the Cradle, because then they can't use it for the Soulwalker Moon to coming up. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to try to, well, uh, okay, I'm going to use uh, Speedus trying to heal up, and I think I still should, I have hyper potions, yep. I have hyper potions of my own. And I'm going to use Peter's turn to use Surf again, because the other Surf should take out the Cradle unless he heals the Cradle. Okay, is this heal they're healing the Zat too apparently. And surprisingly the Zat 2 hasn't used like Sunday yet, which I find very, very surprising. So I I can take another uh, earthquake as I healed it. Yeah. It should take out the Cradle now. There we go, nice. Very well done. That's that too. I want one knockout soon, but you know, it is what it is. Okay, so you're gonna send out Lunatone now. Okay. So, I'm gonna use. Well, I, I, I don't know, cuz. I use Shadow Ball and is that too again. I know, I know it's still gonna be in the reds though. See, that's the thing I'm worried about, cuz like, it looks like a critical hit, but we'll see what happens. Then Surf again. It'll hit them both. Uh, let's hope for a critical hit. Uh, nope, not quite. <laughs> not quite at all. Okay. That two's gonna use Psychic now. Oh, that Combine. The Combine really boosted up the Zatu's Psychic there, yeah. Don't get, you know, too many of those Combines get by you because it can really sweep your team after that then. So, um, 
I don't think Wind of Tornado has anything like an Earthquake, but if it does, that's gonna suck, because, you know, Knights four times with the ground type moves. Oh, it's gonna use Kamwa. Dang it! Okay. We can still win this. Like, the Scythe is gonna hit them both, though. That should take out the Zat 2, then. Okay, there we go. We got rid of Zat 2. Zat 2 did its damage already, though. Which kinda stinks. Okay, not all it means is a Solak and a Winnetone, but the Winnetone's already weakened down a bit. So... I think both of these have the limited ability, so I can't use anything much that. I can try Iron Tail. I'm gonna try Iron Tail on the Winnetone and the Sif again. I'm spamming Sif, I'm sorry guys, it's true. Okay, okay, I know that Solak knows Solar Beam, so I'll take one shot to... use uh, One turn to use Solar Beam instead of just two. So I gotta watch out for that. Oh, okay, I did that much. Dang it. Um, Iron Tail missed. No. 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 That's not good. I'm gonna use Iron Tail and Sif again, because, like, I really need Iron Tail to at least hit once. Let's get a Psychic on me to. Okay, that Solvac didn't get up a Calm Mine, but then that Lunar Tone got up two Calm Mines now. This isn't good. This isn't good at all. This isn't good at all, guys. Okay, the Iron Tail has to hit the Lumitone. I want it in the reds at least. Because I think it, I think they already used their two hyper potions already. They have two hyper potions. Oh, critical hit! Nice, 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 nice. I really like that now. Okay, so there goes the Lumitone. Now all we have to do is deal with the Soul Rock. If one of my, if either Peter or Knight faints, I'm gonna have to go with uh, Prime. But, um, the thing is, Prime is weak to grass type moves, and the Solark has Solar Beam, and it has a Sunday Day up right now. So that doesn't really add up really good. So, um, let's try going all Steel type. Even though I don't get same type of deck most if I used. Instead, if I used Surf 1, Peter, but you know. Steel Wing, yeah. Boom. I think it did slightly more than what a Surf would have done. And then Iron Tail hits. Nice. Yes, we knocked it out. Awesome. That's awesome. We got our seventh gym badge of Hoenn now. Awesome. And I grew level 39. Nice. I like it. What? Our combination was shattered? I can't... It can't be helped. You've won. So in recognition... In, in recognition, take this. Thanks for $16 and all. Oh. Wow, that's a lot more than $16. Thanks for $168, man. And man, man and woman, I don't know. But that's all because, you know, Peter had the ammo coin. The mine badge, yeah, we got the mine badge. Oh yeah. The mine badge enhances the special attack and special defense of Pokemon. It also lets you use the HM move I'll dive outside of battle. You should take, you should also take this too. I think this is the team for Calm Mine. Yeah. The team, that team contains Calm Mind. It raises special attack and it raises special defense. It's a move that's perfect for a psychic type Pokemon. And we registered them in our Pokemon. Nice. So after that, we can just hop on this portal and bring us back to the start. Wow, you're astounding. You're one great trainer. And yeah, if we look over here, must you proceed Pokemon Gym? What is with Liza and Tate's classified trainers? Grodel, it says. So, I didn't mean to go back in. Are you kidding me? I'm having trouble with that. <laughs> Jeez. So, I'm gonna heal up real quick, so see you guys in a second. Okay, so if you see, my first three Pokemon are Peter, Prime, and Blaine. Now, in this upcoming thing, you, um, you, oh shoot, there is Team Magma. Oh, what are they gonna do? What's well, a cutscene. And they're all going towards the space center. So basically, uh, you'll only be able to um, choose three Pokemon for this upcoming boss battle. So yeah, just keep that in mind. I have my three already chosen. Again, they were Peter, Prime, and Blaine. So yeah, but this will be in my Pokemon and we'll walk through guide part. In the next part, we'll take on Team Magma at the space center. So this has been Giant Go again. I'd like to thank you for watching again. Goodbye, and hope to see you guys in the next part of my Pokemon and walk through guide.